from the north, I call Archangel Mikael, Angel of Fire. I call forth the Sword of Truth, Protection and Power. I ask for a blue cross in a blue circle of light. I call the warriors of the flame. From the east, call Archangel Raphael, angel of air. Call the host of healing angels. From the south, I call Archangel Gabriel, angel of water. I call forth the golden chalice. From the west, I call Archangel Uriel, angel of earth. I call forth the tree of life. At the center, I call the light of the Christ, the great white brotherhood, the ascended masters, all of the guides, friends, teachers and helpers who wish to be present, you are welcome. I ask that I may step aside and this journey be conducted from the realms of light. So it is. We bring to you the greetings of the Great White Brotherhood. It is our great delight to meet once more these true warriors. You are the ones who chose to come to this earth from the stars to bring the light the love and the advanced technologies of these higher frequency star systems. And as the earth is now moving through her activation as a fifth dimensional planet, and as each one of you is upgrading your physical, mental and emotional bodies to align with the fifth dimension. So we are come to you this day to be of service in that process. So we would like you now to imagine that you are standing on the shore of a great ocean. On the eastern horizon, a beautiful star is arising from the waters. As she rises above the horizon, she fills the sky with a soft blue white light. This is the, the great star of Sirius, which at this time is rising with the sun. And we have been called for this special time. 
So as this beautiful star rises up over the water, she sends a silver white pathway across the water. And that pathway leads directly to the place where you are standing on the beach, listening to the sound of the waves as they break most gently on the shore. The sound is calming, soothing, soft rippling water washes over your feet. Soft, warm water, soothing and relaxing all of the tension from your body. You are looking out across the ocean where that silver white pathway is glistening in the morning light. It is calling you. It is inviting you. And you find that you can step very easily away from the shore onto that silver white pathway. You find yourself floating very easily along that pathway floating out across the ocean, being drawn towards that beautiful shining star, which is huge on the horizon as she casts her glow across the water. And as you float along that pathway, you are breathing in starlight. You are breathing it into your body. Breathing it in through your skin. Beautiful, soft, silver, blue starlight. It feels as if your body is just melting. And as you float closer to the star, you find yourself floating through the cosmos far away from the earth plane. You are floating higher and higher, floating up away from the earth, from the physical form with all of its issues its burdens. You are being set free, returning home to the light of this beautiful star. 
So as you float higher and higher, you can see the star of Sirius before you now. The silver, <coughs> blue, white beam. is drawing you, pulling you up. And you find yourself now floating in through the outer layers of Sirius. You are floating in to a most beautiful chamber. Which is full of geometrical shapes, designs on the floor, on the ceiling, on the walls. And as you step into this chamber, you find yourself changing form. physical body has completely melted away and you have returned to the form that you wear when you are on this star, which is a home base for you. So just look down, notice the form that you wear when you are home on Sirius. How is this form different from your physical form as a human? Feel the consciousness that you have as this star being. What does that consciousness feel like? What are the qualities of this being? Here on Sirius, the consciousness is of a much higher frequency than the Earth. Here, there is only love and the desire to serve. So just feel yourself as this Syrian being. Look around you, around the chamber. Which is now filling 
with other beings, the elders, the council, the wise ones, those who have invited you here this day. So just notice as these other beings appear in the chamber. They are communicating with you telepathically. They invited you here this day. What is it that they wish to communicate with you? These beings have invited you here at this special time of 7-7 to receive a recalibration of your energy body. So they are inviting you to a special chamber. There are crystal pillars of light forming a circle on the floor is a 12 pointed star made out of crystal. And in the center is the blue-white flame of the Christ. They indicate that you are to enter the flame. So you step forward and you step into that blue white flame, which is coming up from the floor through your feet, through your ankles, your legs, Feeling this cool blue white fire pouring through your whole body from your feet all the way to the top of your head. transforming the structure of your energy body to the Christ light, the inner Christ, the Christ within. All of the old memories of density, of separation, of 
of suffering are being washed clean in the sacred fire, Christ flame. Christ light body is being activated with the consciousness that will take you forward into mastery. This was always the plan. that those who are the starborn would walk upon this earth as living masters. This is the process that you call the ascension. So just feel that now the flame washing through your whole body, transmuting all energies of a lower frequency, old emotions, old mental programs, physical dis-ease, just melting away in the flame of the living Christ. Feel that in your whole body. Activating the codes in the DNA for you to step into the Christ light, which is your birthright and your heritage. And it is time. Now the transformation is complete. So you step out from the flame. And there standing before you is the Lord Sananda who was known as Jesus or Yeshua. He stands with the Blessed Mother Mary and with his consort, Mary Magdalene, Lady Nada. The three of them stand around you in a triangle. Each one raises the palm of one hand. Sends a beam of pure light. Into your heart. A blessing of pure love. This is the quality of 
the Christ consciousness that you have stepped into. Unconditional love without judgment, without expectation, beams of light from each of their palms create a hologram, a new heart. This is the ascended heart, the heart with wings. So feel that hologram infusing into your heart. Activating the highest level of the living Christ. The beloved Master speaks. He says, Go forth now. Be my hands. Be my voice. On the earth plain. Speak words of love. Let your touch be a healing and a comforting. I ask of you that you be my emissaries. on the physical earth plane. That you are the fulfillment of my journey there. You are the blossoming on the tree that was planted When my beloved and I walked upon your earth, let the petals from the tree of love rain down on all for all. This is the time of the great cleansing and the great healing. And it is my request of each one of you. That you be the emissaries of love. I just feel that hologram of your ascended heart made of blue white light that is now merging into your heart.
This is your mission and your purpose now. Simply to be the love that you are, that you have always been. Let us take you now, traveling back through time, to that time when you chose to leave your home in Sirius, to travel to this earth. Let us see your self now, traveling back through time, looking out from this beautiful star and seeing this earth, this planet in all of her beauty. So as you feel yourself now as this being looking out at the earth, what are your feelings? What do you feel for her? Why did you choose to leave this beautiful home on Sirius? To experience separation and suffering, which are unknown here on this star. Look around you at all of the other beings who chose to come with you on this long, long journey, this long cycle into the third dimension. Just look around you and notice the other beings who were choosing to take physical form, but not all as humans. Just look at the other beings who were coming with you. What is their purpose? Why did they choose to come?
What do they wish to say to you at this time about your mission and your purpose with them? As you look down from Sirius and you can see the evolution that the earth has come through as she is returning to the light. What is the stage that she is at now in that evolution. What is happening on the earth with the transformation? Let us return now to the council chamber where the council are waiting. It is time now for you to prepare to return to the earth. Before you leave, These wise elder beings, the Star Council, they have a message for you. There's a beam of blue light, blue, white, silver light coming up from the floor. This is the beam that will bring you back down to the earth. You step into that beam as your Christed I am presence. The Christ light body fully activated. And you find yourself once more floating out 
along the beam, dropping down through the cosmos, down through the stars. And you are dropping down towards this beautiful blue green jewel that is planet Earth. And you are floating down as your Christed being, shining with silver, blue, white light. As you float down, towards the earth. The light is shining from your heart, from your body. And as you look down at this beautiful planet, you feel a great outpouring of love for her. She is working so hard to cleanse, to restore the balance. She needs help. So as you come floating down towards the earth, with Gaia waiting to receive you, what is her message for you? What does she wish to say to you? that you are love. You are a powerful and magnificent being of light, simply wearing a human form. Time to stop playing small. It's time to shine your light and to claim all of the power with which you came to the earth from the stars. as you float down now in this shining Christ light body, you can see your physical form below you in the place that you are in at this time.
just feel this Christed body floating down through the top of your head. Floating in to fill your whole body. with the Christ light. Feel the hologram of perfect love. Enfolding your heart. And expanding. Sending out a beam of the most beautiful Christ light. This is your purpose now. To simply shine the light of love, especially in those places where there is great darkness. See your whole body, which is now glowing with light. That is for you to share. So wherever you journey now, you'll be shining your light. Sending it out from your heart, bringing love, comfort and healing. Sending it down through your feet. To bless the earth. To restore balance and harmony. To planet earth. Touching each one who stands in your energy field with unconditional love.
Just imagine now that you are sharing this light with those around you. As they receive the light, your family, your loved ones, people who come into your energy field. Just notice the effect that this light of the Christ has on them. is your purpose now, to be the light of the world, to shine light in the darkness. Feel that light glowing in your whole body. Restoring the balance, physical, mental, emotional. As you bathe in your own light, the light of the Christ within. So now, Just begin to bring that light into the place that you are in, becoming aware of the room around you. Sending down a root through your feet into Mother Earth, inviting her to bring you back in. Deepening the breath, bringing your attention back to the body, to the physical world. Very slowly now, beginning to stretch Moving your fingers, 
moving your toes as you very slowly bring yourself back to this time to this plane bringing with you all of the light within. Mm -hmm. 